And now, to the millions and millions of listeners and viewers all across the world. Let's go. It's the That's Not Christian Podcast. Dale, dale, dale. So we interrupt this portion of the show to talk about a channel sponsor, Eurific. Eurific is a wand, sanitizing wand. Because I know you've been thinking in this pandemic era, what can I do to be more safe? You know, so one of the best that. things, yeah, one of the best things you could do is you could get a Eurific wand. It's simple, easy, rechargeable. It is an ultraviolet light. You take it, you turn it on, you can put it on your phone, just simply go over it. And you've killed a good amount of germs. So with that being said, go to Eurific.com, go purchase it. It's on sale right now. You're going to get free shipping and you're also going to get $10 off by using the special code. Now you're going to ask me, what's that special code? And it's simply easy. I was it is code TNC. That's it. Voila. You are blessed now. Thank you for uh, listening. And we now return to our regularly scheduled cool. program. <laughs> Yes, sir. Yo, this, this dude is good, man. <laughs> like, he's been practicing that in front of the yeah. mirror every morning, right? <laughs> yeah. Yo, he had the whole thing down. That's fly. I like that. I'm going to get like you that. terrific. <laughs> no, terrific is terrific. Yo, we, yeah, need a jingle. So, uh, we need a jingle for your riffic. That's for sure. Right. It, it yeah. could start with something about CHH getting cleansed. <laughs> or you mean like you what trying to get, mean? you trying to. Like wipe out people? You trying to? What do you mean? Yeah, what does that mean? To, nah, that mean? nah, nah. We're not gonna wipe out people. I mean, so some people saying? might think certain people should be wiped out, but nah, we Christian here. Right. So <laughs> what I was thinking is, you know, wipe away any fixing, beef, right? Yeah, wipe away any beef. You know, restoration. Shout out to Cray One One Six. You already know. I like. I like oh, restoration. Wow. What a Keep plug. a One One Six. Yo, is this dude sending you bag? bags or something? Yeah. No, yeah for real, man. Attack. Y'all didn't. Y'all didn't check the account. No. Nah. Oh, this dude. Oh, man. You can't yeah, see but... your account. This oh. dude. <laughs> Send me this something, dude. man. But yeah, man. Last week, uh, we had our brother Jay from the Hip Hop's Corner. Shout, Shout out, out to the crew. Out. Crew. Shout out to him from the crew. Shout out uh, to Chris too, man. Yeah. Shout yeah. out to Chris as well. Um, we had that planned ahead of time. You know what I mean? As a guest. And um, right when we were starting, usually we ask our guests, we go over the topics and we also say, hey, is there anything you want to speak about? And Jay goes, hey, you know what? I just got this a tweet. Came in the radar. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Breaking news. <laughs> Breaking news. Yeah. So actually just how it laid out. Just how. Yeah. yeah. Exactly how it happened. Uh, John Gibbs had made his statements regarding his label situation and uh, you you all know y'all can go back to the episode and see exactly what he said. Um, I believe that post is still up on IG as well. Um, so yeah, so when Jay said that, we said, "All right, let's go for it." You know what I mean? Let's talk about it. And uh, we gave our opinions on the situation. Um, I believe that our opinions were more in favor of the label, um, including obviously Ruslan, right? Because his name was mentioned. Um, and you guys can all check. You know what I mean? Check the YouTube and all that. So um, recently, well, what was it? A couple of days ago, uh, Ruslan High responded to John Gibbs. And man, it was super impressive the way that he went about it, right? What, what did y'all think about that whole, uh, you know, how he handled that? You know what I mean? I think it was very gracious. Um, and he was just like an open book, just, you know, his live, talking about, you know, the situation and, you know, he he pretty much said what we were saying. Well, he showed, how he he showed receipts. Yeah, he showed receipts. He he said the same thing. Like, hey, you know, he was the one that was out, you know, booking everything and shooting everything and like all this other stuff, you know. So, um, and, but what surprised the most was, you know, right at the end of the live, he gave uh, he gave uh, John Gibbs his fifty percent of the his of half the, of the masters. Yeah, his, of the masters yeah, which is yeah he, wow. he he gave over he gave over his ruslan gave over his own portion of the masters which they had agreed upon and and uh john gives had agreed to um through through the um the recommendation of his lawyer right because he said 
uh, John Gibbs said that his lawyer said that the contract was cool, right? Right. Mm-hmm. Um, so I think Ruslan was entitled to that, but he's 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 definitely a big man for giving that up to him, you know. Mm-hmm. And then and then um, something interesting happened. Ruslan um, had a conversation. He said he said with I think he said something with like his 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 friend or his brother or something like that. He didn't name him by Mitchell name. Friend, I think. Yeah, he said something mm-hmm. like that. Um, where there, there was a misunderstanding, right? Yeah. Simply a misunderstanding. Um, and that was it. I guess, I guess John Gibbs didn't know that he was getting paid those years because John Gibbs, John Gibbs also had responded, uh, right after Ruslan, like I think a day later Yeah, and spoke his piece and basically did on IG live, right? Yeah. And basically was saying, Hey, look, you know, I ain't, I wasn't getting paid, you know what I'm saying? And um, so, you know, he spoke his piece and then Ruslan responded with that. Uh, well, he actually pinned it in like a YouTube video. Um, I think somebody screenshotted and sent it to us and we saw it and we were like, OK, cool. So, you know, praise God, you know, things are getting um, reconciled and, you know, yeah. that's most important. You know, what that's I mean? the most important thing, you know, that no one souls. uh what do you call that? Discord, right? <laughs> Causing division with, amongst the body or even right. amongst people that are outside of the body that we want to be, you know, everyone wants to be peacemakers in this whole situation. Absolutely. So, cool beans, man. Shout out to them. Shout out to Bruce Lawn. Shout, Shout out to, to Unity, Gibbs. Restoration and all that good stuff, man. The fact that we could we could we could resolve issues without sending a cease and desist letter or taking any type of legal action. You know what I'm saying? Like we could talk about it less than grown men. You know what I mean? Facts. And, and listen, man, if if y'all ever feel a certain type of way about us, you know, we not mind readers. You know what I'm saying? You know, we only going to we only going to speak what's on our docket, what's on our, our, our opinions on the situation. Um, you know, at us, you know what I mean? Come at us, come speak to us, you know what I mean? If you feel a certain type of way. And another thing, man, if y'all don't want your business out there, man, don't put it out in the public. You know what I'm saying? That was the era I came from. You don't want your business out there. You know, I hear people say, well, oh, mind your business, da, da, da. Don't put your business out there in the public. You know what I'm saying? Oh, handle it, about. handle it through DM, text each other. Handle the situation, you know what I mean? Handle it graciously and privately. Or we're going to talk about it and then you're going to be mad. <laughs> <laughs> Shop, that's not Christian.com. Right, Check it know. out. Use promo code TNC10. You know what I mean? To get 10% off. Get your Watch Your Mouth Beloved t-shirts. Get your oh. Christian Podcast t-shirts. All that good stuff. 